guys, it is Soul Trick here and welcome back to another YouTube video. Today I'm going not to be doing football once again because it's been real because it's been raining down here really heavy and the grass is really really wet and mucky so it'll get all dirty. So today I'm going to be doing another episode of um a game my iPad called Geometry Dash again. Um, number two, so let's just get straight into this. Why, well, by the way, if you didn't watch my my Geometry Dash number one tutorial yet, I would recommend to. So, anyway, let's get into this. So, last episode we completed the first level, which is called Stereo Madness. The second level, which is called Back and Track. And the third level, which is called Poltergeist. So today we're beating the. So today we're beating the fourth, fifth. And six levels, which are dry out, base after base, and can't let go. So first of all, we are doing dry out, and the face is green, which means it's a normal level. <coughs> so literally, just game, just basic gameplay. Um, there's, I don't think there's anything new in this level, honestly, except for. I think there might be different decoration. Oh, I, how you get this first coin here, I think is, yeah, you jump once and then you let So, once you get here, you jump and hold. Once you jump. Then you get, oh, I, so, if you're wondering what that yellow port, if you're wondering what that yellow portal was right there, that, that turns you upside down, so you will need to go into practice mode for a wee while and try to learn this bit and dry out. So that's that's the upside down bit. I don't think there is any more. And then once you get to the end, of the, oh, you jump. You have to jump really late there to get that coin. And then here's just the ship. And then I think there's a new thing in this level. No, there isn't. Never mind. So this coin's really hard. You need to go right up here and try and fly, fly through the gap. So, um, literally just keep on jumping, and then you're at the end, so I will go, and then that's you. Yeah, that's you then, so, the next level is going to be base after base. As you can see, it's a yellow face. Wait, what is it? It's a yellow face, so that means it's a hard level, so, take a wee while. I'm getting used to this so once oh gosh once again just normal jumps like jumping over um spikes and yet there's jump orbs in this just let you know and this first coin how you get it is actually pretty quite weird yeah once you get the um we think it's three blocks three thin blocks you have to let go and then here, don't get distracted by the giant um, orbs. So here, it will take, if you're only starting, this black zone will take you a really, really long time to get used to. Because for beginners, it's really hard. Oh, I missed a coin there, sorry. Right, so you have to jump over all three of them and then just uh, ship again, just like normal. So you have to really concentrate here. So how to get this coin is so you dodge in two spikes, hold. Then just keep on holding and then let go when you see floor. So when this upside down bit will take a wee while as well. Which is very annoying. So how, if you're wondering how I'm doing these all first tries because I'm all used to them. And they're all very easy to me. Well not very easy, they're quite easy. So and then yeah just watch out for that jump there. Three spikes. And then that jump at the end as well, I guess. And then once you're... And then that's you with the level. And the next one is actually pretty hard. I know it's just a hard face, so it's probably the hardest hard for me. Oh, whoops. The next level is called Can't Let Go. So, 
yes, this will take a little bit of use. You know, this will take a little bit of practice. So, um, it looks easy, but it actually isn't. It's actually pretty hard. Right, so you have to hit the middle one there. So, yeah, that's how you do. A wee first bit there. I'm gonna stick on inside. So then do nothing. Then once you come there in the platform, jump. Um, and then this will take a really long time getting used to as well. Cause you won't really be used to a black background. Yeah. Tap all four of them. And then tap all four of these as well. Hold. And then right soon. This coins. Oh crap! Oh, that was close. Right, our coins hard to get. So um, just up and down, up and down, up and down. And then you come and do the other side. Don't keep it again. So then um, you just have to get used to it once again. I'm sorry. This game needs a lot of memorization and just getting good at it, practicing even. What I mean. Well, this bit at the end is actually really hard as well. If you're a beginner, you need to get all your jumps spot on. And then once you're at the end of it, that's you. So um, yeah. Um, so we're done our three main levels for the day. So today I'm just going to show you some levels that I've created. And um, so one le one level that I've created is called Supernova. I need to find it first. And then I'll show you do um Supernova. So yes, here it is, Supernova. Um. If you can see, yeah, supernova. So, um, it's a really easy level. Um, but if you're only beginning, if you're only a beginner, actually, this level would be really handy for you. Aye. So, wait, though, you know, so them, them blue jump orbs, you see them, them we jump orbs, they actually turn you upside down. So, you got to remember that. And then, so you just keep on doing this. And there's a ship bit. Supernova. Um, so, yep, yeah, don't get distracted by oh, uh, them red ones as you just saw their boost jump really high. So, um, don't get distracted by the decorations around the jump orbs or just the exact same. So, the thing that I'm in right now is called the robot. If you hold, you can jump high like that. And you have to jump all over three them. So yeah. And then this new thing that you're going to come to is called a wave. If you hold it goes up and if you don't hold it goes down. But if you go through a yellow portal and you're in the wave. If you hold it goes down and if you don't hold it goes up. So this is a yellow portal wave. Oh well. Well I'll show you the rest of my level next. Next time, um, no, another one that I've created is, um, was it here? Colorblind is another one. Um, if you, never mind, I, it's alright. Um, so, crap. Um, so this one's literally just, so how you get back ones, t you tap twice. So, like this, when you're on that platform, just stay one, two, uh, yeah, so, one, two, yeah, like that. Then yeah, them, then we orange portals with like three of them. Yeah, then we orange portals that have like three of them. Ch change the direction you're going a little bit. Just change away. So um, you're in the ship at then. Yeah. Wave cube. Wave. You need to get used to what what color the portals are to change. So blue's the wave. Pink is the ship, green is just the normal cube, um, white is the robot, and um, so now we're just gonna try to. Oh, I, so now we're gonna um, open some of our chests. So if you don't know what this is, so you need to get five keys, which is how you do that. If so you complete main levels, which is how you do that, if you get under this main screen, you click this here that button you press search then just press search and then well if you have internet you need internet connection as well if you press search or it'll be um all online novels of people around the world randomly have made so i'd say you get keys when you get five of them you can unlock this room here 
and um, a key. It's a keeper chest, so you can't just go opening all of them. So, so watch it. See, you now I have four. Now I have three because I just opened one chest, and yeah, I got two hundred orbs. Um, what's in this one? I've got one diamond. This one I got one poison diamond, and then in this one I've got two diamonds. Um, so I need two more chests to unlock. Well, if you if you get fifty chests, you get we icon or something. If you get a hundred, you get a color, and if you get two hundred, I'm not sh I'm not sure what you get because I'm two chests away. So I'm just going to end it there. Um, yeah, I'm just going to end it there. So if you enjoyed this video, please like and leave a good comment and smash. Yeah, smash that like button and subscribe. I would really appreciate it once again. And see you.